Welcome back. Thanks for watching. Good morning, Connecticut. An event to help raise money to fight breast cancer and educate girls about the cancer. Laurelton Hall in Milford is hosting the first annual Marianne Wassel Daisy Run. And joining us this morning is Marianne's daughter, Betsy Nyland, president of the Get in Touch Foundation, and Erin Pinsons, a physics teacher at Laurelton Hall and the school coordinator of the Daisy Run. Thank you so much for being here, ladies. Thank you for having us. Of course. So, Betsy, first of all, thank you so much for being here, and I'm very sorry to hear about your loss. Thank you. Uh, so, obviously, she must be the inspiration for all of this. Can you explain what the Get in Touch Foundation is about? Absolutely. So, the Get in Touch Foundation is a global breast health nonprofit organization, and we teach guys and gals of all ages on the importance of breast health education. And through that, we have our Daisy Wheel and Girls program, which we provide free to schools all around the world. Um, we target grades 5 through 12. And on our Daisy Wheel, there's eight tips on how to do breast self-exam. And school nurses can go to our website and order these Daisy Wheels, and we will ship them to their school for free. And why is it so important? And you might be able to speak to this better, but either of you. Um, why is it so important to really get girls thinking about this at a young age? We like, we suggest, um, we, well, we recommend teaching girls um, starting in fifth grade because that's when um, their body starts to change. They go through puberty. We want to teach them how to be their own health advocates at a young age um, so they're equipped and armed um, as they grow older of with course. this information. Kind of just get them in the routine so mm -hmm. they understand. Um, Laurelton Hall, uh, talk about the work that you've been doing there to get ready for the Daisy Run. October's been busy. Um, <laughs> we, well, first we decorate the whole school inside and out with pink decorations. We have fundraisers. Um, we actually had two girls sort of on their own, Millie Koch and Liz Garfield, who did a YouTube video called The Boob Song. Um, it's hilarious, but it really does get in touch with the importance of early education and how important it is to these girls. And they're sort of just coming into their own, too, in high school. So it's very important to maintain their comfort level with talking about breast health, making sure that there's someone that they can talk to about it. So it's very important that we integrate it. I think the boob song is there. And you know, <laughs> humor is a really great way to reach young people. So it definitely makes sense. Um, and especially young people connecting with young people as well. Great way to do some outreach there. So if folks want to come out to the Daisy Run, how can they do that today? So they can show up, they, sh they can go to the school at 1230 um, and register, and if you want to talk about the details. Sure, um, it's on our new beautiful turf field. Um, it's a $10 registration fee, which gets you a t-shirt, a Subway lunch donated by Re River Street Subway in Milford, and a raffle ticket. Um, we have a whole bunch of raffles, gifts, vic uh, gift cards, guest watches, I mean amazing things. And then uh, there are more raffle tickets for purchase as well. Um, 1230 to 3 o'clock, it should be a beautiful day, so know, hopefully everyone day. can stop down. There are um, events for the whole family also. Uh, our physics and engineering kids have come up with crossbows and pendulum bowling and <laughs> pumpkin checking, so it'll be fun. Ooh, pumpkin checking. Yes. Fun. <laughs> well, thank you so much, ladies. Uh, some great information, and uh, good luck today. I hope you get a big turnout. Thank, thank you, you so much. Very much. Of course. And for more information on the run and the Get in Touch Foundation, just head to our website, WTN. Com. Just click on that on air tab and pull it down to the Good Morning Connecticut weekend section. We'll be right back in two minutes.